Hello guys, my name is Peter and you are looking AVA Group Media Channel. Today we start a new series about Sonoff. We will talk about what Sonoff is, what type of Sonoffs are there on the market and what you have to do if the Sonoff doesn't want to connect with your phone, how you can force to connect it and later on in the series we will speak about how you can install your own software. Yes, you can do it yourself to be independent from the original EV Link software, which is coming with Sonoff. If you are interested, then subscribe for the channel and stay with us. We start right now. Okay, but first of all, what is a Sonoff? A Sonoff is a family of things like this original Sonoff switch. This is working only with Wi-Fi and you can control with this your electrical devices, which is connected to that. This has a second version, which is the Sonoff RF which means this has a radio receiver, which means you can control this Sonoff with this uh, remote control, what you can place on your key ring or whatever. In the same time, you can control this by internet and this radio control unit. The next one is the Sonoff S20. This is a simple wall plug. You plug it in your wall, it will power up. Everything what you plug in here on this side, you can control it via your phone through the internet. And the newest one is the Sonoff Mini. The Sonoff Mini, as you see, is very small, as the name says. And my plan is to install it behind the wall switch. And I can control with this my lights in the room on the ceiling while this is installed into the wall. Right now I'm missing only a couple of millimeters, but if I um, remove a little bit wall behind the switch, I will be able to install it. We will see it soon. The next step is that I show you how to connect your devices with a Sonoff. The S20, you just have to plug it in your wall socket, but here you have to make a little bit electrical job. I show you. This is the Sonoff and originally there were four screws holding these caps. If we remove these caps, you can see the four connections for the cables. It is very important that on the input side we disconnect the cable or we remove the electricity as the Sonoff is working with 330 volts. It can hurt you or even it can cause death. The text writes input and output. On the input side we connect the power source and on the output side we connect our lamps or electrical devices. For the test we use this 330 volt cable with a plug on it. It's very important that the cable has end caps on them. The best tool is a face finder. With the face finder screwdriver you can check if the input side is under power and the size of the screwdriver is perfect to actuate this small. If you know the polarity of your cable, you should connect it uh, accordingly. Always the brown side is the phase and the blue side is natural. By this cord it is not relevant as you can plug it in both ways into the socket. So we connect the brown side to the L, 
and the blue side to the end connector. We put back the caps. It is very important that the cap is also preventing this cable to be turned out of the device as the, the cap is fixing the cable and you can see that the connectors are not really strong. On the output side we connect a electrical device in this case our renovation lamp. Again we connect the brown to the L and the blue to the N connector and if we plug the device into power we can see that the green LED is blinking as soon the LED is lit continuously, the device could make a connection with the server. If the connection is established, we can actuate the Sonoff device via our cell phone. So, the video is quite long now, so we stop here. Please subscribe for the channel and hit the like button, share this video with your friends. In the next episodes, we will show you how to connect the Sonoff with your phone, even if he doesn't want to do that. And then later on, we wire up a Sonoff Mini. And after that, we will show you how to install your own software on a Sonoff. Okay, Google, TV einschalten. Natürlich, ich schalte das TV ein. Okay, Google. Mini einschalten. Natürlich, ich schalte das Mini ein. Okay, Google. Mini einschalten. Klar, ich schalte das Mini ein. Okay, Google. Mini ausschalten. Na klar, ich schalte das.